everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Victoria and usually I'm talking about everything related to hockey and baseball from across the pond in Scotland. But today I am actually in Canada and I have a very fun sporty weekend ahead planned up in Toronto. So I thought I would vlog it. I did a vlog of my first baseball games but this one is more weekend in the city, a lot more footage that I want to get than what I got last time because I was just soaking it in. So I'm very excited for the weekend ahead and I'm excited to capture it in video form because that's my favourite thing to do. So I'm in London right now but we are just about to head off and go up to the city. I'm so excited guys, you've no idea. So let's go have a fun weekend in Toronto with lots of sports. Let's go. That you don't find cause you got me I don't wanna break your little bubble But you gotta wake up to reality Cause I can see in your eyes Your head is full of dreams Tears are a proof of failure You just gotta let them flow without judge Where are you going? Jeez. Jace, Blue Jace, let's go. Let's go. You just gotta trust the right. Don't have to be scary. You just gotta follow the light. You're able to be happy. You can do whatever you like. Again. Again. What we're doing this time though, we're, we're fancy this time. We're in the box. We're in a box. The lounge, sorry. Normal. Yeah, lounge. Yeah, yeah. Normal. Let's go be fancy for the day. in London, loved being up in Toronto for the weekend, got to, as you just saw in lovely b-roll form, two baseball games, we went on the Friday, got some like seats in the 200s, uh, it was obviously Pride weekend, it was so much fun and uh, really enjoyed that, even though got to see my first extra innings and they lost and how they lost I've no idea because realistically they really should have won that one then on saturday got into the ticketmaster lounge which was just like luxury you know i got great food that was just the perfect vibe like the weather 
was it was lovely and sunny and nice and I was just sitting there eating some flatbread mac and cheese and cheesecake with wine overlooking like the game with the most amazing view so that was just spectacular the seats are so comfy and just the whole lounge area was just really really nice so we got to both of those and then we were meant to go to the Canadian Open on Sunday but so tired I feel like for three weeks almost we haven't really stopped so it got to Sunday and I just felt like my entire body was just done so we were meant to go to the golf but it was a lot of walking around it was going to be kind of difficult to get to and get back to London so we just came back and we watched the golf on TV and we watched the Jays game on TV and why did the Jays how could they only win the one game that I wasn't there this weekend like they lost the two I was there and then I watched one on TV and they win that one Come on, come on, Jace. Like, come on, you were, you were owe me like one win this weekend. My success rate for the Jays winning while I'm there is not great. They've only won one game while I've been there. But then whenever they're playing and I'm over here, but I don't go to the game, they win. So I don't know if I'm a good luck charm or a bad luck charm, I can't tell anymore. But it was such a nice weekend. Um, obviously because we were meant to be at the golf, I was like, oh, that'll be a nice little segment for the vlog. We also, in addition to the sports stuff, on Saturday night, we just spontaneously decided we were gonna to go to the Dermot Kennedy concert on the Budweiser stage in Toronto, which was very out of the blue. We. We knew it was on, we were like, oh, we might go. And then we're, we're, we're sitting after the Jays game, we're sitting in real sports with Ryan and one of Ryan's best friends. And we're sitting there and Ryan's like, do you want to go to Dermot Kennedy? And I'm like, yeah, sure. So we jumped on the train, went to the concert. It was amazing, it was so much fun. I really liked Dermot Kennedy. Um, didn't realise he was as well loved over here as what he is, given that he's like Irish. So that was nice to see. Um, I would just so excited. I was so excited to see the Budweiser stage because it's such an amazing venue and it looks so nice. And I was very impressed by it. I was getting sore arms <laughs> standing up there, so I thought I'd sit down instead. So I'm still here for another few days, and I still have some content ideas in my head but unfortunately the Jays are away now for the rest of the time that I'm here which is slightly devastating but I'm sure I'll be back. I just can't believe I've been here for this is like the third week I've been here and it just doesn't feel like I've been here that long which is insane. Um, I am excited to go back and see my mum and my dog though I will say. When I came over in November it was only for like a week and I don't feel like I got a full experience then whereas I feel like now especially because the weather's been nicer this time I've been able to see a lot more and do a lot more and like get my bearings a little which is really nice I really like London this is Ryan's apartment Ryan lives in London and um, yeah I, I love this area it's really nice I obviously love Toronto so much like the city especially at night see just like you know you're driving along at night and you just see like all the lights oh my god it's just majestic i love it so much so this is my weekend in the city vlog if you guys want me to vlog i think we're doing like niagara falls and more like toronto stuff before i go home so if you guys want me to vlog that sure or maybe you guys are like sick of my many little vlogs at this point you might be that's also okay but let me know if you do want to see that because i can definitely film those two. And I'm gonna stop rambling now. So thank you so much for watching guys. I'll drop all my social media links down below. Follow me in there if you aren't already. I post lots of stuff to Twitter and Instagram too. And I'll be back soon with more hockey and baseball chats from across the pond, even though I'm not across the pond right now. But that's my like tagline, you know? <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for watching. See you soon.